Nothing beats spending time in the great outdoors with our canine companions. But how can we make sure that we all have lots of fun outside while ensuring the safety and happiness of everyone around us? Going to the park can be a sensory overload for our dogs. Just think of all the new people, new dogs and smells. If dogs are off lead, it's really important their recall skills are good. That way they can avoid passing bikes, nervous dogs and wildlife that might not want to be disturbed. Some dogs absolutely love saying hello to strangers, and lots of people love that too. But make sure the person your dog is approaching does in fact want to say hello. Even if a passerby is keen on their attention, they might not want a trendy new muddy paw print design on their clothes. So be sure to work on greeting people calmly with all four paws on the ground. Making friends is the best thing ever for lots of dogs, but some are less keen. Be mindful of dogs on leads, dogs that are nervous, and dogs that might not want to play today. Every dog can get overwhelmed sometimes. Be sure to pop your dog on their lead or change route if needed. Some dogs can get pretty excited when they find a picnic. All this food laid out for them to enjoy. If you have concerns about your dog helping themselves to a round of sandwiches, keeping them on a lead with something to do can be a good plan. When the weather heats up, always try to remember our dogs are wearing fur coats and can't sweat. It's fair to say they find the hot weather much harder than we do. A lot of dogs love lying in the sun or chasing the ball for hours on end. They might not understand they're too hot, so it's important to give them a helping paw and keeping them cool. Remember, if you need any help practicing these skills, a qualified trainer will be able to help you and your pup enjoy the great outdoors together.